Welcome back to episode 8. Horang's Nightmare, The Ghost on the Highway. Six AM. I was driving home one morning after sleeping over at a friend's place. Wow, this fog is unbelievable. I was supposed to come home the night before, but I was too drunk to drive, so I ended up sleeping at his place and left first thing the next morning. I could barely see anything in the thick fog that day, but I knew that road like the back of my hand and I didn't slow down. What was that? I felt a chill run down my spine. Did I just see a ghost? I checked my side view mirror, but there was nothing there. Man, I must be really tired. I need to get home and get some more sleep. I have no idea how long I drove. I eventually ran out of gas, even though I had nearly a full tank when I left my friend's place that morning. Crap, there aren't any gas stations around here. That's when I saw a gas station just ahead. It looked like it had been built ages ago. Is no one here? Maybe it's self-service. How much would you like? Uh, oh, a full tank of unleaded, please. Hmm. What a creepy old man. But that's so weird. I don't remember there being a gas station here. We offer a free bottle of water or a pack of tissues. Which would you like? I'll take the water. Thanks. The man kept looking into my car for some reason. I'll go get your water. I'll be right back. Sure, no problem.
Fueling is complete. Please place the nozzle back on the pump and take your card. My tank was full, but the old man didn't come back. Where did he go? Maybe I should have just said I don't need... What? My ears started bleeding badly and everything went quiet. And just then... What the? I shut the passenger side window as fast as I could. The man kept yelling something at me, but I couldn't make out what it was. What is he saying? <laughs> hey, what the hell? I just bought this car. What? I put the car in reverse and floored it. You've got to be kidding me. Is he senile? Behind me? Ah! I jumped out of the car and ran for my life. And then I passed out. When I woke up, I was in a hospital. When my father saw that I was awake, he started shouting excitedly, but I could barely make out anything he said. It turns out that my eardrums had ruptured. They said it would take some time for them to heal. My father told me I had run my car into a guardrail and over a cliff. My car then caught on fire and was completely destroyed. Apparently, I had managed barely to survive by crawling out of the car just before it burned up. I didn't know what to make of it all. I told my father about the gas station and about the old man that had tried to get me out of the car. Did he look like this? What? But how?
This is your grandfather. He passed away when you were still small. He used to run a gas station. I was speechless. And okay, wow. So I'm guessing he had an accident because of either the fog or the ghost. Maybe the ghost caused the accident, and the grandfather made him get out of the car because it was burning. What do y'all think? As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you all next week.